This video is not for the sensitive hoes. The ones who can't take anyone else's opinions except for their own. If you can't have a mature conversation, then darling, this video is not for you. You will be blocked immediately. Now remember to keep it cute, keep it mute, or get the boot. Now preparing to nanny port to Nina's raw view in 3, a 2, a 1. Much team too much because we can relate. <laughs> yeah, we're definitely. I like the crazy ones because like we're crazy. But I really do love Nina. Like I love going mm -hmm. over to her channel and I like how she's just unfiltered and she doesn't give a fuck. She really like she'll always give her honest opinion and I love that she's not very like PR kind of what are those like the, Miss America like very yeah. yeah it's like she's not like politically correct all the time and she just says it like it is I really appreciate that and there's something that draws me to her and I just feel like she's so talented and yes. she deserves all the recognition in the world I mean everyone knows she's talented as, as fuck but I feel like she deserves to be that bitch like everyone standing like hardcore <laughs> So good. So good. Mm -hmm. You like it? I like it all. Mm -hmm. Oh my gosh. Oh. Oh, hey guys. Sorry. Oh, how are you guys doing? Right now, if Rodal looks like a ghost, mm -hmm. it's not her, it's the ring light. <laughs> Like, she's back. Y'all all hated her, so, so, so she decided to come back. <laughs> back by unpopular non-demand. <laughs> Yo, Fish is back. Oh, sorry. Uh, how'd you know? How'd you guess? Or how'd you smell? I can smell it. <laughs> I'm offended and triggered. Oh, God. I'm so sorry. Victorious Santiago. Santiago. <laughs> No, for real. Does that word offend you? I go by Victor. Victor. Okay. <laughs> no, for real. Does that does that word offend you? No, of course not. Like, no. why would you find it offensive? Because I'm a fish. Fish means you're like cream of the crop. Right. For the girls. Uh huh. You know. Right. And by girls, I mean the grown ass men who dress up and drag. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. So yeah. Or, and it's like yeah. it's like you know. Of course, she doesn't speak for every female exactly you know, you know neither does victoria but you know for the majority of people i know that word don't bother them it's like girl unless you smell like fish then you would get a, then, it's, it's, yeah. it's a difference in you smell like fish versus yeah. fish yeah it's a difference like it's yeah. like context but anyway we're back for an all new season of rupaul's drag race season 15 girl can you believe it's 15 season of drag race it's a long time can't. That's a long time. It actually has been like 15, it's been more than 15 seasons. Well, but yeah. Because of everything the, else. Oh, yeah. So much. Yeah. So yeah, much yeah. to keep up with. I can't. Yeah. It is. Sorry. So we went to the, oh, rewind. Anybody new here? You yeah, know how we do it here. Keep it cute. Keep it mute. Or you will get the boot. boot. Okay. So okay. look, if you will come here in the comment section, you're free to state your opinions. Just keep it respectful. That's all. Like, we don't need all the nasty negativity and all that kind of stuff. Just, you know, and I may not like your favorite outfits or wigs or what they do, but it's fine. It's fine. Like, like they're they still don't even know you. <laughs> yeah. And they're going to live their life anyway. <laughs> No, some of them have came around already and been like, "Oh, thank you for like when I, when I did the meet the meet the queens." They were like, yeah. they're like, "Oh, thank you for your words and stuff." Or they were Honestly. laughing at yeah, or they were laughing at things well, I said. Well, what's funny is that like every anybody who actually watches you knows that there's never any ill will or right. intent. It's always like the ones who don't watch. Uh, yeah, it's always the ones who don't watch who watch a clip like uh -huh. that was like spinned out of mm -hmm. you know out of hatred. Who are the first ones who'd be like, "Yeah, he's, he's right. hating." Like, mm -hmm. no. If you heard the whole thing, you would right. And <laughs> you know? everybody knows that I like throwing like slight, just humor exactly. shade. It's just like it's just a little shade. It used like, to be no, the no. fun part of drag, and yeah. they took that out yeah. of that too. Yeah. Yeah. They took the fun part out. But what's, funny, <laughs> what's funny though? These new girls will come around only because, like, I guess when you're new on the show, you want to hear what everybody has to say about you, right? Mm -hmm. But so they'll come around first, like being like, you know, like because of interest, but then like want to get more fame and stuff. Then I never hear from them again. Yeah, <laughs> it always right. happens that way. They always <laughs> you know. have to. It's like they have to like. Check in and be like, let me get with the controversial, per con controversial quote unquote, mm -hmm. to get some, you know, whatever. Speaking of that, surprisingly, have you seen the cast yet at all? Mm -mm. At all? Like you haven't seen? Like, Actually, no, no, no. You did. Um, you showed them in the right in the, the that meet, last meet the queens yeah thing. the meet the queens and it was like the.
Hello, hi guys, it's me again. I'm sorry, this is a quick, abrupt video. I just realized that um, I'm getting old. My stomach's getting big, my knees are bad. I haven't quite achieved the way to turn light skin. So I just haven't been feeling the best and I feel like drag is just solely not for me anymore. So I just wanted to say that I wanna give Okay, so I don't really claim anybody as my drag kids at all, but there's an upcoming drag artist named Align, but now they're named Lucky Stars. So any new drag race girl out there, technically a drag race girl who has good knees, light skin, hot to the trot, and you don't mind maybe taking in somebody to be your child where you can guide them how to do better duck walks because my duck walks are over. My time is over actually, but I want y'all to like maybe embrace her and take her in. The name is Lucky Stars. If y'all are interested, please message me on Instagram. Thank you. Twins. The tw so yeah. I like the twins. So we have to, unfortunately, Yeah. I, 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 I hate the word stan, but unfortunately we have to like them right now right now. because they like me so right. we have to but like i actually them. did like them already like the concept i didn't that was new that was something i was like oh okay that's something new and then there was another one that i liked there too well apparently they have like millions and millions of followers uh, on, on tiktok they're they're those kind of girls mm. i think it was a chunky queen oh, okay the like one a, that a bigger one the one i said look like eureka yeah but i like she, her no no i so i so <laughs> what's her name don't get mad at me. Look, it's too many names to keep up with. But yeah, um, she's not trying to RuPaul you. No, no, no. <laughs> right? No, exactly. <laughs> no, but she, I, I heard that she was blocking anybody that said she looked Eureka. But when she messaged me, she made she, she kind of joked about it and stuff. Oh, that's yeah. Good. So it was kind of like a, a little sense funny. Of humor, but yeah. I had to no. But what made her more like Eureka was that I was watching one of her performances, <laughs> and Eureka got in trouble for saying for doing a song that had the N word. Mm. Literally, the same person has an N word in her mix, and she's saying it. I'm like, you are Eureka. <laughs> and Eureka got canceled. <laughs> yes. They're like, just bring her back as another person. <laughs> Basically, I'm sorry. Anybody who's not black, like, we get it. You are allowed to like these black songs. That's fine. <laughs> but if you're going to do it for a mix, whatever, at least do the clean version or beep that part out. I'm just saying, like, because it'd be, it be all these white people in the audience being like, my name. Like, no. Mm. Like, no. Want your back that thing up. Call me Big Daddy when you're back the thing. Go, go, shorty. It's your birthday. We're going to party like. <laughs> okay. I hate this. No. <laughs> <laughs> They're having fun. But what I. Yeah, no. People, they. But that's fun. That is fun. They want the culture, but they don't want people that made the culture. But, ha but yeah, have fun, course, child. Have yeah. fun. But anyway, so. That's a different conversation for the podcast we're never Yeah, yeah. That's, a, that's right. <laughs> <laughs> that's for the imaginary podcast. That's for the not podcast. This is your comment, actually. What? I don't, know, I don't know what it is from. It says, to piggyback on what that person said about the falling out with franchise, I really hope a better production company, not affiliated with RuPaul's, pick you up, to be honest. Their team only does what their toxic fans want them to do. Not what they want to do is taking the essence out of drag as an art form. They're not as creative anymore, and I really want to see more of you in all your forms, not just drag. They will only take people they can mold and control in the way that they approve or deem appropriate. You're so very talented, and I would like to see you truly shine and support. Aww, it's thank true. you. No, I'm serious. Because well, people think, think, think that I am the one that like fell out with them. No, I just don't like what they have done and treat certain people, but they don't want to fell out with me because I haven't done anything to them, you know, mm -hmm, you know besides mm -hmm. speak the truth, like, or read Ru RuPaul's read wigs. Yeah, yeah. I mean, her wigs are bad. I'm sorry. Like, yeah. I mean, but <laughs> I mean, I'm not going to, like, lie about it. Like, the hairline is bad, girl. Yeah. I'm sorry. But but besides that, I haven't done nothing for them to, like, yeah. kind of, like, blackmail me, black, blacklist me or whatever, you know? Like, that's enough. <laughs> or maybe because, oh, like, don't like my wig. but I really, I, really, I really think it's because they see, oh, these people have canceled her, so let's act like we can wash our hands with that person so we don't get canceled. But meaning they, but they work with people that have done and way worse I, things. That's yeah. what I meant by that, because it's right. like, that's what I don't like about, like, sort of, like, Holly weird and that whole side of things. It's almost like, you know, nowadays, and I don't know if it was like this before, but now everything is like a PR stunt, mm -hmm. you know? And, you know, everything's like, oh, what is going to help us maintain our image so that we can make money or keep ratings or mm -hmm. whatever? But it's like, you know, I understand that. But at the same time, life is not like that. 
you know, sometimes people mess up. Sometimes people don't say the, the, the right things. And I don't think there's such thing as a right thing. I think that everyone has their perspective. Everyone mm -hmm. has their opinion. You may not like it, but that doesn't mean that you have to cancel that person right. or that person is bad or they're not worthy right. of a show or something like mm -hmm. that just because you don't agree with it. Right. You know, because I mean, th and that takes the, away the creativity of Hollywood because then you don't have different perspectives you don't have different mindsets and right. it's like it's it's become so like narrow-minded to the point where everything looks the same everything sounds the same everything there's no like competition or argument sometimes arguments are a good thing because then you're mm -hmm. like oh it's adding a little you know a little character you, you don't have to like be evil to a person right. like and tear them down but right. you, you don't have to agree with them right exactly. you know what i'm saying like i could be like i hate her shoes and you're like i like them you know it's just like okay. you know okay well okay moving on right like no but nowadays it's like oh no you're canceled because you're hating you on should her. die you're not supporting her right you're 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 low-key hating like what like, no. no i just don't like her shoes <laughs> Yeah. But to them, it's like you're yeah, like nowadays it's like you read their mom or something. It's yeah, like, no, I just and don't like back in the day, like they would read the crap out of you. Like yeah. remember the drag shows, they would read the girls. Like oh, right. if you went to a drag show pre whatever this craziness is, like the girls would read you. Like, right. No, literally. Her. And even like, back then, Michelle Massage and them would, would read the girls like where's your, bo <laughs> where's your body? Why aren't you yeah, padded? Why are you like a boy on stage? I remember when um, they would. I remember at Lips during your birthday. They would have you come on stage at Lips, mm -hmm. at the drag shows. There's a restaurant in Atlanta called Lips, and it's like all the drag queens, and they're like working at a drag, like drag show restaurant. And on your birthday, you get invited to stage, and they will one by one read you before they give you their like right. take a picture. Remember, mm -hmm. nowadays everyone would be canceled. Right like, now, you couldn't do that. Like no, no. it's so crazy. I know. It's like it's just fun and games, and just like take a joke. Well, they can't. <laughs> Uh, well, I think we're ready for this. I mean, I don't know if she's going to stick around for the whole time. Hope she will. Two hour, <laughs> take a shot. <laughs> this two-hour like, no, premiere. Sure. This two-hour premiere. So we're going to go ahead and get to it and um, see what the girls are giving this season. And like I said, if we if we don't like something, they don't, don't take it personal, right? And plus, Radal knows what she's talking about. Cause I know a lot of y'all like, like were saying like, she don't even really know, but you know, like she knows what she's talking about. Like she may not have, to, she may not watch every season and stuff like that, but she knows what drag is and all that stuff. So, yeah. so it's like I actually have been in drag places with actual drag queens. I don't just watch them on television, right? Like some of y'all. Right. No, no, I mean, but for real. <laughs> like no, seriously, it's like you don't have to know the whole storyline sometimes to have an opinion, right? You know, it's like initial thoughts you know right. you could see like a picture it's like going to the museum right. and like seeing a, a portrait right. and be like you know i think that the artist maybe felt this this and that and you're right. like actually he was depressed and right. he didn't have an ear right <laughs> and you're like oh okay i didn't know that but you right. know right right well i mean it's true <laughs> come on people right like, so don't take so just anyway she's here and get over it well, guys if we're dark right now it's because we have the ring light literally like mm. shining right at us and we want to be able to watch the show and really enjoy it, you know. Mm. So, um, and also, I meant to mention, if you would like to tip and support, please do. Please tip. It keeps Tipping me. It's not a country in it's China. It's not a country in China. It really is. You can Google it. Um, <laughs> <laughs> and don't tip her. She's a woman. She's, she'll be okay. Right. Um, <laughs> yeah. So, yes. Yeah, I'm going to do you like Meg, Megan did <laughs> with your ear. Oh, <laughs> way over there. <laughs> Yeah, wait till y'all see, wait till y'all see that ear part. You'll be like, okay, really? Are you excited at all? At all? Like when you see Drag Race comes on, are you like, oh, yes? No, not at all. Okay, okay. I'm only excited for your raw views. Okay. I like. I wish it would speed up. Scary. Okay, so Irene Dubois from mm -hmm. Seattle. Are we feeling the look? I like the look. The, are you gonna buy I like rent the it? Fairy. I, I will buy it. Okay. I'll buy it. I'll rent it. She claims to be like her aesthetic is supposed to be like very alien queen. I don't get alien. Me either. I get fairy. Right. Very renaissancey fairy right. kind of um fantasy mm -hmm. kind of but not what you just said. Were you feeling her um I mean I'm assuming she's I'm, I think out of drag she's like boy. Like were you feeling mm -hmm. her were you feeling her her look in Yeah, he's very Seattle. Okay, right. Very, like weird. Very that. Yeah, yeah. Weird, weird, yeah, weird, yeah. weird. Do your, do your sound effect. <laughs> like, weird, weird. weird. Right. <laughs> very that. Very, very, that. very, very weird. Okay, so I yeah, I rent the look, she buys it. Okay. 
in the 80s. See, normally, yeah. <laughs> normally when I think somebody walks in first or like, like yeah. I, I feel like they're going far sometimes, but, yeah. but maybe they change it. But it used to be like, is yeah. somebody coming first or last? You're like, those are the girls you know, look out for. Yeah. You know what I can see him reigning as? You remember the old Power Rangers movies where they'd have these characters that were aliens from a different world? Mm-hmm. He gives me the, like that. I, I, like a character from a Power Rangers movie. I don't know if that's a read or not, but <laughs> that's what she said. <laughs> My drag sister, and we sort of oh, came up with So, you know, Bosco was on the last season. Doesn't Bosco look like Sasha Valor? There's so many seasons, I can't keep up with all of them. You have to look at Sasha Valor again. That's literally her twins. And Sasha. Valor. Yeah. She came out trans on the last season. Mm. Drag scene together. Mm-hmm. For sure. So, we have Lux Lenore. Like she's like very. Gen Z, very. I said in my left though, she she's black, but she gives me she's been around a bunch of, you know, mm-hmm. she's co- from Joy Z, right? Caucasians, she's you know, you can Joy-Z. hear it in her, you can hear it in her voice. Secretly. She's kind of like, well, you know, Wendy Williams was kind of like that, you know, she was kind of like the only black girl in her neighborhood type. Yeah, but Maybe. Wendy to me still is black, black. Like this person right here, very really, true, true. really is like. Her parents are very. Yeah, you know, yeah, yeah. Um, grounded. She and also I said she reminds me of Azealia Banks. Yes. literally her yes. face and everything absolutely she does a weird thing if we could make it wise where normally people like make their nose look smaller mm-hmm. she likes to bring this line across yeah to i like make it. her you like that mm-hmm. hmm. it looks kind of like lioness type uh, okay like she looks kind of like a lion and i'm mad she has a human wig because you know ronaldo bought me a human wig a it's, human wig once yeah i don't know what kind of human you it was to, uh, strain it and- no, I tried, no no <laughs> just simply brushing it hair was coming out each brush and mind you, it had a sickening. The, the girl, the hairline was like real. And he, yeah. I said, I said well, Mr. Ronaldo, what, what kind of human is this? What from what 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 dimension? What what earth? Like uh, anyway. So yeah. so I, when I see human waste, I get I get mad. Yeah. But as far as this look good. goes, I'm gonna buy it. I like it. It's too, clean. Yeah. I'm gonna buy it. It's yeah. simple. It's very seventies kind of. Yeah. You know. Wait, what's going on here though? Like maybe. I can see through. She, she could have hid that more. No, I can, I can see. Oh, you can see the underwear. Yeah, oh, yeah. Oh, oh, okay. No, no, no. It's fine. No, but still though, you can see that she could have she could have put on a, maybe a little more tight or something to hide that. Just saying. Okay. Yeah, you're the expert. It's yeah. just saying. If I had to spread my drug That's session, true. Yeah, you see, you, see, you see all that. Yeah, yeah. you can wear the thong. Yeah. No, it's 40 inches. Trust. No, it's not. Girl, they're already reading. I don't think it's 40 I either. Know. I wasn't getting 40 either. I mean, like, maybe. We're see, going in. But I feel like on her, because she's so short, mm-hmm. it probably is 40. But me, <laughs> it'll be a bob. Yeah, it's like 20. It'll be a bob. <laughs> it'll stop right here. Right, right. I'll, I'll have a shortcut. Exactly. Yeah, I don't know that's like, 40. No, girl, it's 30. And you're but you know how they do, though? Short. They'll get. The 40 is never, like, all the way straight down. It's, yeah. like, layered. Yeah. Like, yeah. you know what I'm saying? But, exactly. you know, always. Oh, she's a messy bitch, and I like it. Oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> she's not buying it. Oh, my God. Very nice. It reminds me of your mm-hmm. face. Oh, thank you. Oh, you're <gasps> I wonder if she know her. Cause I'm like she's really going in her. I, I live I for she's, it. She's gonna win the um the reading challenges. Oh my god. Oh no, she's probably already canceled. Oh yeah. Like probably. literally going on Insta- Instagram now. Know. They're like she's already apologizing. She, We're like, right, we liked you. Right, she had death threats. <laughs> already. You came from a black girl's hair. Right. Oh. oh. She's like, well, it's not her hair. It's I mean, the internalized uh, <laughs> racism. <laughs> they just throw all the the key terms. Right. Like canceling people. Cute. So that's Aura Mayari. She's very cute. Oh, don't don't blow her head up because she already thinks they said that like, she already thinks she's the trade of the season. Oh, he's with, so with cute, with there's but no you're trade. Not trade. Right, right, right. You're not trade. Right. You're a trade. I'm just joking. <laughs> <laughs> okay. None of us are trade. No, no, none, none of y'all are trade. <laughs> right. Trade is. Let me explain because we had a conversation about this the other day. Oh. Let me explain what fish trade gonna tell is. y'all. Fish I'm gonna tell y'all what trade is. Trade tell, is. Tell fish. Trade is when a straight girl can actually think that she has a chance with this man uh-huh. but he actually is going over to pierre's house uh-huh. to play uno exactly or video games okay but i'm over here in his dms like baby i love you good night and not getting a response exactly that's straight <laughs> not a man who has a a, a, no. a, a fitted trade and <laughs> <laughs> Trey and, don't do drag and Jordan. Trey don't even. Trey don't even don't even know who RuPaul is. But like who's RuPaul, who's, right? Who's, literally, who's that? literally, okay. they're no fighting about the NFL. No, for real, <laughs> they, they really don't. But really. he, but, but he's but cute. gonna go play Uno with Pierre, right? But his outfit, 
I'm going to buy it. I like it. Love it. Yeah. yeah. Love it. It's clean. It's, it's nice. It's giving me very much, um, um, what was that movie with um, Mortal Kombat kind of? Like, okay. I love it. Mm-hmm. Are you Filipino? Goddess. Oh, hey, hey. No, nah, I'm sorry. I don't like when guys are so into themselves. I don't like it. It turns I, me off. I don't either. It's too. It's too. It's like, yeah. Like uh, and, and like I don't know. So I can't tell if he's kidding because like he's meet the queens, but he seems very full of himself. And it's like mm-hmm. it's okay to be confident, but then at some point mm-hmm. it comes off a little too like cocky. Yeah. Like, but you know, some people don't mind when certain people are cocky, but like right. people who they don't like who are cocky, like, they're yeah. like, "Girl, get over yourself." Right, you know, but, right. but for him, they'll be like, "Yeah." Right. Or you the are. moment, like, let's say, for example, the moment you started feeling yourself, right. they'll, like for real, they'll read me, and then they'll be like, "Shut up, you're just depressed." You're anyway. just, right, right, right. <laughs> like you're faking right. no, your they would. You're like, "Wait, I thought y'all wanted me to be confident." Right, no, no. It, it's <laughs> and the then they'll truth. bring back your old. Past. It's the truth. They would. Yeah, they would. They, they, would, they would do that to me. I know. Like, I know. Yeah, but we'll see with him. I guess. Right. Yeah. I'm a performer. What are you guys excited about? All right, we get it. Right, I'm really mad that she didn't cut the lace. I'm <laughs> so mad. <laughs> and then that didn't even try to blend it. Right. Like, if, if it was weird that you're that girl and you're everything, we shouldn't see your lace. Yeah. No shade. I'm not even reading, no. but we sh- I shouldn't see your lace. Ow. Oh. My nose. <laughs> that was cute. It was that like, was really cute. On just brand, like on brand. Just like the Brady Bunch. Yeah. For the young people. Right. Y'all got to go back and the time nose gets and smushed. Understand what happens to Marsha. Oh, it's, that was cute. Yeah, that was super cute. Um. But okay, so her style is very mod. Like even even it. even in the Meet the Queens, it was very yeah. kind of basic. Do you? I mean, but do you think it's like worth? Oh, like like the world is just now seeing you for the first time ever. Like, do you think it's like? So she doesn't no. give me drag queen. She gives me like pretty girl. Mm-hmm. You know, right? Like the other girls, I'm getting more drag out right. of them. Like she just kind of gives me influencer kind of. Cute so would you rent or buy this? Um, I would. I would rent it. Okay. Because I, honestly, I, I'm like, I feel like I get this now from anybody. Clueless is in. Yeah. Mm-hmm. You know, this is like the new thing everyone's trying right. to do where the, the plaid and stuff. Right. And it's not like. Right. Yeah. I rent it. Plus, she, yeah. she seems sweet, actually. Yeah, I like her. Right. I, th- and, I think what I'm talking more so about the look. Right. And I will yeah. say um, so far, just really quick, that I do, even though, even though, even though the girls are being messy, but I like that it's already showing like. Oh, this gonna be tension. some. Yeah, 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 yeah. I'm really like, okay. Like the, this little Jersey girl like started speaking up though, but right. not getting mad or being like one of those girls who's like crying. Right. You know, but she doesn't have any boobs. Mm. She scammed me. She was the one who scammed me in Las Vegas. <laughs> Seriously. Okay, so my first impressions, like seeing her and then seeing her confessional. I'm not reading, but mm-hmm. I, to me, the face was kind of the same. Like I can't, mm-hmm. and maybe it's this headpiece that's kind of making it's her look piece. a little more manly, a little it's bit. The headpiece, yeah. yeah it's like I don't think we need the headpiece. Yeah, we don't. Like yeah. the outfit, but, but without the headpiece, Is, I would buy. Yeah, cool. Yeah, really cool. And she's not you wearing know what any I would have done. I don't know. If she does it. I know she would have had a chest. That would right. Have been a banger. Like I know. That. And then I don't know if she would have had this like around the neck, maybe. Right. Or something like that. But. Just not that part. Because like, it's just like making her look manly. Yeah. I mean, for just sure. being honest. But the outfit, yeah. I would still like buy the outfit. Yeah. So like, yeah. no, no no read. I'm and just I saying. I kind of like the, this outfit or with the shoes. Mm-hmm. Kind of like the first one had would look better than those little espadrilles. And do you think shoes. she should have some fishnets? Or like a, or some black, like knee high thigh? actually would be something. nice. But I like, I mean, I don't see anything wrong with this. Okay. Either. As in drag. <laughs> And as a guy, to me, she kind of even looks like detox a little bit. Y'all, y'all see y'all a little bit. So we got Malaysia baby doll fossils. Okay, do you watch Sailor Moon at all? Back in the day when I was a kid. But this is very but Sailor yeah, Moon. Yeah, that's very yeah. Such yeah. It's like the plus size like Sailor Moon like Sailor it. Scout. Yeah, I'm gonna buy it. And I like how she has that little, like the little fox. Yeah, uh uh-huh. Tail. Yeah. Mm-hmm. <laughs> I really like that. I'll buy it. Yeah, I'll buy it. It's too. clean. I love the dress. Honestly, it looks kind of like my prom dress. Right. Really. She's our first plus size queen to enter the room so all right she looks polished let's she see she looks like a fox for real mm-hmm. i'm homo i didn't find that that sickening like in her mind she was like i'm about to really have the best entrance line I'm i don't know what that meant though phobic she just said like she's homophobic but it's like it was like okay <laughs> <laughs> like okay, I'm um, like, cancel her. I'm not excited, but only because like, I like the outfit, though. I'm getting like Miss Cracker. I'm getting um, I'm getting like just regular no, just like skinny white 
twink girl who doesn't pad and just yeah. like you know yeah. like is it like yeah. oh I'm like you know but I mean and I, actually cute. now that I'm looking now I don't see any boob real boobs no there's no like really yeah. nothing like I mean like I mean it's yeah. cute I like, like you're con- not bad I like the concept for like a kindergarten you know. <sighs> you know uh like talent show or oh. something you know <laughs> like the little girls come out and they're like doing their, you know what i mean that's really like cute John Bonnet or it. something yeah like a jump that's really cute for a john Bonnet. oh wait maybe oh. she would have some paint drops on her Bonnet, on her top yeah. well thinking of pageants little 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 girl pageants yeah maybe some paint drops could have been on the top but i mean i'm gonna just honestly i'm not gonna buy her in this one it doesn't really excite me all at all but you i like it okay. um it's for me it's um i'm gonna do one of your like i'm gonna I'm gonna pick it up. Okay. I'm gonna go. I'm gonna be super excited, mm-hmm. and then I'm gonna put it on. Mm-hmm. Look at myself in the mirror. Right. And then I'm gonna start touching the the material. Uh-huh. And start realizing that it doesn't kind of match the price. And then you. And then I'm gonna put it up. back. Uh-huh. And then I'm gonna like cut like a little hole into it, and then go to the counter and be like, "Hey, can I get ten percent off? Y'all have a hole in this." Right. And then it'll be like actually take 20 percent off and i'm be like okay perfect deal and i'll walk out and with then it. you'll get it home in the closet and never wear it yeah never wear it got it <laughs> <laughs> a little bit i can see that oh well that, that's his you should have played the little boy that's his, <laughs> that's his all-stars <laughs> talent girl mm-hmm. she's a painter or she may be a drag queen oh she's been performing for like a year and a half See, that's, that's nobody respect. No, but that's most of the girls that they are getting now on the show because I feel like they kind of went through, ran through some of the drag queens that were maybe before Drag Race, kind of like they, and now all they have left, and I'm reading anything, but like are like the girls who've been watching Drag Race when they were younger, and now they're insta insta yes, drag. Yes, and this is what I was just yeah. that was okay. I was gonna say mm-hmm. is that I don't feel like the younger generation really understands drag. No, because they they've been watching it they've been seeing it but they're also almost like these little tiktok and instagram girls that are they'll do like their makeup Mm -hmm. you know yeah but it's like they never leave their house no you know and so it's just like a weird dynamic it's almost like i mean neither do i yeah but you well you look alike yeah i'm like you don't leave your house anymore but (laughs) <laughs> but, but but I live I have yeah. lived that drag queen yeah. life before drag race. Been on all stage, that. been yeah. you know performing, know how to banter. Right, all the shade that that girl threw at her, like another drag queen would have came back with something else. Right, you know it would have been banter. It would have been like it's almost like when Naomi Campbell was mad at these Insta models. Like yeah. for her, for her and Claudia and but them. I get it though. No, but I'm saying for her and Claudia and them, they were like actual models. Like they had, like right. they didn't have all that. But these girls yeah. now can just put on makeup and look all yeah. you know and get on. And they have it's funny because they have like perfect skin and they're like in their 20s. Obviously, they they look amazing and they're like, look at this concealer. I'm gonna put this concealer on and it's like you don't even have bags, right, or anything. <laughs> So now when she goes home, she has a light and it looks good on camera. She comes here. It's not much going on. But that's and what you're comparing to these girls who are doing it up. You got it. You got it. You have to step it up. You have to step it up. Right. But that's how it is now. Mm-hmm. Period. Okay. So you don't know. But okay, so Sasha Kobe is trans. Okay. She's known um, from like doing pageants and stuff. I worked. I worked with her when I did this that this this video where I was like Whitney. You, you probably seen it in like Eureka was Mariah, and Aja was Christina. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. So mm-hmm. you know when I, when I met her, she is sweet. She mm-hmm. is. You know, um, she's actually Polynesian, um, mm-hmm. but she she tanned herself a lot though because she was really pale. Mm-hmm. But a lot of these kids mm-hmm. are already hyping her. Mm-hmm. Not even know who she is, mm-hmm. but, but just because they hear that she mm-hmm. is um, mm-hmm. trans, mm-hmm. they're already going to automatically mm-hmm. hype her because right, she's done. Not, they're going to get canceled. Right, because pageantry, <laughs> they don't, they don't know who she is, mm-hmm. but already they're calling her icon and legend. It's <laughs> like, it's like, okay, I, it's like, let's, that, that's fine, but yeah. no, get to know her first. Let's see what she does on the show. You know, I don't like, mm-hmm. I don't like when people overhype people. And this is my right thing. Away. Treat people equally because, like, this is my thing with this kind of stuff too it's like let's say for example i'm like the first hispanic queen or whatever right and then they're like oh my god look she's the first icon icon and then like if i do something that's mediocre no one will say anything to me they're right. like oh, oh, beautiful amazing right. and it's right. just like but it's not but and it's you're not, not right. and you're not making me better and you're not making the the art form better right either. exactly and this it's just not real right like 
stop it. And, and we're not talking or, about we're not talking about her. No, 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 we're no, just, just saying in the, general the behavior of right. the 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 fans. Yeah. and how they act. They'll let yeah. their faves or icons fly or slide with anything they do. Mm-hmm. But somebody who they hate, They're not icons. Though, yeah, no, no, yeah. It's like, but anyway, um, is, is an icon. Oh, and her and she she's the <laughs> she. This is an icon. Oh, Whitney, just, that, that that's icon. Exactly. It is. But like, so her her daughter was on mm-hmm. the last season. Saw, um, named Kiri Kobe. Oh. Yeah. So mm-hmm, now mm-hmm, she's mm-hmm. on here. So yeah. Okay. But the, as far as her look goes, she looks good. I I'm like it. I'm rent it. Mm-hmm. Yeah. I'm I love it. it. It's very. Um, it reminds me of the mummy kind of. Remember mm-hmm. the mummy when the she had like the. She had that like gold body. Mm-hmm. And it's giving me that. Right. So and it's, it's very like Polynesian. Very warrior. Are those coconuts? Yeah. Uh, are they onions? Well, they're coconuts because she's doing the Polynesian thing. So, right. You know the Polynesians they do the um tattoos. Right. Okay. Oh my god, how many more? Oh, <laughs> no, they did it. Wait, but somebody else did that. Remember the black girl? I think that's her. The one oh. with the head. The one like <laughs> But I think somebody is wearing her oh look god, and I doing remember. it. Okay, yeah. No, I remember. <laughs> oh who is this? Let me see. <laughs> oh. Oh. That was so cute. But the gag is, she has, she has no idea who on who, who Yeah, yeah. She probably she's like, this is gonna be funny. I'm gonna. She's like, I'm gonna go viral with this. <laughs> like, like, I don't know why. I'm but the first to do it. I, I, they want me to. I, who's vivacious? What, what's, what's the season six? I don't know. You're like, look, just watch this video. But she was a judge before, though. On mm. um, I can't remember which which season it was, but um, I okay. I know that that she is big mm-hmm, or whatever. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. I still I still think with where they're at now they could have probably found somebody mm-hmm. bigger somebody new somebody bigger i think mean, I, I, I can't explain Who's it like bigger than ariana grande beyonce and them i'm just you know beyonce's not gonna go on i know she's not <laughs> but i'm just saying though because it's like even for us like we have lady gaga i'm like yeah but maybe because like i'm way out of that range now i was gonna say this is ariana is the lady gaga of for them this generation yeah for yeah. like for yeah. like yeah for, yeah for for lux and them you know yeah. so I'm, I'm not i'm not reading her i like her I mean, yeah, we, yeah. girl y'all, y'all know i did greedy eh, for my little things you know but um mm-hmm. i don't think they could have like maybe got somebody you know but hey whatever it's all but that was that was mm-hmm. now that was kind of iconic though no, I hate using that word, but that I, that was, was kind of that was that was amazing. That was a great interview. Because only that, it gets props to Vivacious. Yes, and nobody talks talks about her anymore. So that's Aww. really good. I know she's probably really happy right now. I didn't I, so, I didn't go to her Instagram actually. That's so funny. And it good. is because her is. her entrance was <laughs> it, unforgettable. Awesome. Yeah. Superstar is honestly the greatest thing. Do you think Ariana has had too much work done? You think she's had work done? Oh no, she has. Yeah, really? you can tell. Yeah. It's very like. I think the only thing I she had is like her without job. You oh. know she's had, she's had whether it's not surgery per se. I think it was just her job. No, she surgery. has fillers. She has mm-hmm. Botox. She has a lift. Yeah, she has a lift. Her eyes are lifted. Yeah, for a, it, it was even a, even a doctor you did like like she has work done. I'm not. I'm I, not mad at her I though. Guess, I guess like because I don't look. I don't really me follow either. her. Me either. It, she looks the same to me. No, especially other no, than the nose job that I remember but, she looked. Different when she was younger. No, look at that. Thing. Look at look at her from that from that Victoria show, and then now like no no that's a whole other person. Okay. I know it, it, it's not just the makeup. Like no, like mm, her, I see the yeah. thing with the cheeks. Yeah, she snatched girl. Yeah. She is Botox and everything. Yeah, I'm not mad though. I mean, yeah. I think the amazing moment, and all of your lives are changing. Oh, say that again. Like, <laughs> no. So Ariana was saying that you know, once you get on here, your life has changed forever for good, and it's like mm-hmm. that's not for everybody. Mm-hmm. Unless you fall into the hands of the RuPaul Drag Race fan. Fan, uh, toxic fan club. Right. Then now uh, your your career will be short lived. <laughs> oh, I like that blazer. Okay, rule. Well, you know, oh, the cash prize used to be a hundred thousand. It's two hundred thousand. That's amazing. That's, that's great. I don't think that's a lot. I think it's time for you to go back to Austin. <laughs> <laughs> no, but, uh, but but no, but where they're at now and how many season of money they have, it honestly should be five hundred thousand dollars. Yeah, or Man, a I mean, million. Yeah, no, for real. To be a millionaire. <laughs> yeah. I do, but yeah. And you didn't do half. You didn't do half the work at all. No, <laughs> and I'm it was a millionaire you. show in the 2000s. No, they have the budget to make five hundred thousand dollars. This is we're in 2023. Who wants to be a millionaire? Was filmed in the 2000s, right? And all you had to do was sit up there for an hour and answer some pretty tough questions. Oh, uh, we all remember me doing RuPaul doing Who Wants to Be a Millionaire. Shaka Khan. No. <laughs> but 
these people go through a lot more work. Right. Through weeks and, and, and they only get $500,000. No, $200,000 now. $200,000? Yeah. Come on, RuPaul. Y'all could do better. No, they can. But RuPaul, say, RuPaul says she got she got paid for her farm. <laughs> Meanwhile, Ariana's like, $200,000? <laughs> That's in my purse. <laughs> Okay, this is fun. Like, this reminds me of, like, when they used to actually, like, have the queens go outside mm-hmm, and do stuff. Mm-hmm. So, like, them going outside and... Wait, oh, it's a green screen. This is a green screen? Is it? Oh, I'd be too embarrassed for, for them to wash my car. <laughs> <laughs> Your car? What's funny? <laughs> Your car? Yes. Okay, that's hilarious. <laughs> that would be so funny if they had... This in Seattle while I pour weird... But wouldn't you hate that? If you got there all done up, Mm-hmm. Maybe one of your best wigs in costume, and they say, and then "Guess they, what? Yeah, We're gonna I pour water on yeah. you." <laughs> um, I'd be so. I don't like to. I don't like to get wet with clothes on. Yeah. Right. No. It's like a weird. I'd be over it. Mm-hmm. Wait, she's padded. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> oh. Oh. She going for the penis. You saw. I know, right? <laughs> oh, sorry. She got distracted. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, okay. Thank God they let them dry up because, like, no, that rope would be freezing. So, come from that water, I, I would oh, be over it. I would literally just get naked. I will have pneumonia in my pants. That's her. Okay, but just now he kind of looked like when Martin used to play that little snot nosed little boy. On Martin, on Martin's show with a snotty nose. <laughs> Martin would climb on his knees. <laughs> no. <laughs> I, I don't remember that. Do you remember that? just like. My face. I guess she was smart for not wearing a wig. Yeah. For this. So. Yeah. Quick thinking. I like it. This is a high Ew. <laughs> Such that a was so pose. stink. <laughs> <laughs> that was definitely a bottom pose. <laughs> you guys, she went downstairs. Let me smell the chair. Smell like fish. Did you get out of drag? I can't tell. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> but she's not the only one though like even when they were doing the water hose thing i was like well some of y'all just have on vaseline so i mean he's acting now no shade tell me lux don't look, don't look, look the same just now from what we just saw 10 minutes ago I literally just forgot that it's we haven't seen all the queens. I forgot. Like this is not all no, time. how many queens is this? One, two, three, four, five, six. Why I feel like it's been more? No, it's and then Sasha. Wait, how many? Am I missing somebody else? This is a big season. That's literally. I would have thought that was it. Oh my god. Clock her as being someone. But why is out of drag? Um, what's her name? The alien one. Mm-hmm. Giving me, you, you, have, you have to see her, but she's giving me um, Abby on Last of Us 2, the butch, the butch stud. <laughs> oh, y'all know the one, the one that killed Joel. Oh, you know the one. one night only. <laughs> so they're having the one night talent, the talent show, where the girls get, get the show there. Talent. Mm-hmm. Oh. So one of them has an ear talent. We already mm-hmm. saw that. Mm-hmm. One of the them. The other one is a roaster. Mm-hmm. She roasts. The other one has 40 inches. Mm-hmm. <laughs> mm-hmm. <laughs> <laughs> well, man, one thing I noticed about a lot of Filipinos, they want to show you all their teeth. They have beautiful smiles. But like, when they laugh, do you see that you see the back of their tonsils? They you don't see smiles. every teeth. <laughs> you know, um, Bruno Mars. I'm thinking that he's half Filipino and he has a really big smile too. Bubbles, it's time for beauty and looks with Dina Bovina Brow. <laughs> The hair is giving, is giving, and there has been beauty and looks with Nina Bonina Brown. Is this the meeting for the Itty Bitty Ass Pity Committee? Oh, 
Okay, this is Selena. First of all, her name is Selena S. Titties. Oh my god, I, I can't tell if it's a character or she's being herself. Like, I mean, like good. I know what you mean. Good for TV, I guess. But she is like I saw a her. character. Yeah. Right. Yeah. I'm like, she's oh my very god. Much a character. Like, oh said, my god. Yes. She's like loud and. Oh, I get it. So all the outfit, I don't like it. Yeah, I don't either. Because <laughs> she's trying to do the chola thing, and it's like we get it. Uh, she looks like um, almost like a, a Spanish version to be of, of a widow, Von Doom. Um, but I'm yeah, I'm not gonna. I'm gonna walk past this and say, "Oh, look at Takis," <laughs> and then <laughs> look at the Takis, and go get that and walk out. Honestly, yeah, no, no, no. makeup. <laughs> Not Ruth Kim Theater. <laughs> that was funny. Is this thing on? It's Amethyst. So Amethyst has came to my page or whatever, like my DM. You know, because I read her about... <laughs> she she is such... Amethyst is like Blossom. The show, the, do y'all remember the show Blossom? She's very Blossom. She's that, you know, like she's she's cute. She is. It's that, it's that nose. <laughs> it's just, that nose. That, that, that nose. But she... I mean, it's... At first, at first, I thought she had on like baggy, like tan pants. At first, I don't know yeah. what, what what it was going on, but it's cute. I mean, I'll rent it. Yeah, um, I like her name because when I was growing up, I told you this earlier that I had a singing group called Amethyst Angels. Mm -hmm. So I already like her name. Mm -hmm. Um, I like the outfit, but I just feel like it's basic. Yeah, it's like something that you could find at Forever Twenty One, literally. Right, and and nothing, you know, like walking but in. But I like it though. I like holographic. I like anything that's like holographic right. print, or not print, but maybe she would, she, would, she would also have like a matching holographic sun. Yeah, somebody sunbiter. said that very into Y two K aesthetic. Yes, it's very Y two K. But the thing about Y two K right now, it's very in, so it's easy to find. It's something you can walk into Forever Twenty One and you can pick it up. You know, so this is what this is the vibe I, I'm getting from her. Like she's just doing the, you know. But it's fun though. I like the shades yeah, it's, and everything. It's fun. I would rent it. Right. Influenced by the I hate the shoes. Era. Oh, okay. So cool to be the first viral TikTok. We are in such different times. Like nobody. He looks like. <laughs> oh, <dear>. Saturday <laughs> Night Live. Okay. Well, as I was saying, while well, he's trying to find that, <laughs> we're we're such in different times of like. Who would think you would, you you would care about going viral on on TikTok? <laughs> like like who would think it was like. Back then, your biggest accomplishments were like doing a pageant or something, and now it's like I have eight million k views on TikTok. Like priorities, they're changing. Andy Samberg, yeah. yes, that's his name. Do y'all know who Andy Samberg is, people? Oh, Make room for your MVP. oh my god! <laughs> <laughs> what <in> the? <laughs> I wish y'all could have seen her face. <laughs> oh. I mean, it's... The hair's nice. Yeah. <laughs> I'm like, uh... No, I, you know what I think? It, it, it's not her fault. She looks like a skater. A nice she's, I think because she's just so small. She's so small. Like, this, this, this is like, like... She's like a figure skater. And then where's your... I mean, maybe being that your body is kind of like so like built in a way yeah. maybe a chest could have helped or something like it's and like it's the shoes too because she's cutting off her the leg right you know she looks small but the shoes are cute yeah they're making cute, her look they're smaller making her look smaller yeah <laughs> yeah mm -hmm. you don't like it at all like, no i don't i'm trying to see what she does with it okay. like what is she gonna do i mean off this coat? my name is Jax, and i'm the simone Bonnet. he's a cute boy Bonnet? now Ooh, i love Samoans. he's a cute I boy you i love Samoans. right and Polynesians. I you love said Polynesians. <laughs> yeah, it, it's the no chess at all for me. It's literally just. Me. It's just like, where's the chess? Yeah. Young men out there doing drag. If y'all don't draw on a nipple, <laughs> if y'all don't put at least at le put like put like two grapes there, like because, because their excuse is, well, all women aren't shaped the same. Okay. But you are a. Don't try to be lazy with it. Right. Don't try to be. No. Uh -uh. You are a man. Yeah. See, those are those are women. That's yeah. how. So but they're gonna still have a little. And you know a what's little funny? Shape. Is that the women who don't have any were, were like, I wish I had bigger boobs. No, like, they. Or I know. They'll get some, or but, you know, like. But still, the point is, or, you. Or not, I have not. I haven't gotten big boobs. You are a man. Yeah. So you can't get away with that excuse. You have to still try to yeah. sell us a illusion. Yeah. 
sorry like you and have to like, self-solution appreciate it like uh, come, come on now like like and, and let's be uh, in real life real yeah okay if, if that's the case what and no shade to women out there who may not be the most curvaceous women mm-hmm. but what man is saying i want to be shaped like that yeah nobody's yeah. saying that yeah, so nobody's like, saying no, that. no, no let's, one's let's looking be real. at my body and saying wow i'll go stop it no, but but like, no, but seriously, because you you think about it, they're like, okay, we, I want a bustier woman, a bigger, you know, maybe like a curve. Mm-hmm. I mean, I'm not saying my my body is bad. I, right. I have a nice body, I think. But like, I'm just saying, you know, what I'm saying, mm-hmm. like a Marilyn Monroe. You know what I right. mean? That's what people look for. Yeah, and it's not, and and, and it's no, and like, that's fine. It's not saying that other women's our bodies no. aren't beautiful. Like exactly. now, like now, but it's like, but if you are, yeah. but, but if you're doing drag, the point is, and I don't care what y'all say, right. the point is to give the opposite illusion of exactly. whatever you're doing yes. you need to give the opposite illusion yeah. so just yeah. just because you put on a wig and makeup right. that's not enough like no yeah. you need to give me like something yeah i i appreciate the queens who do yeah i really do i i honestly they it's a dying breed yeah. anymore i mean i'm puerto rican <laughs> but still you know i'm like <laughs> I'm husband. so that's lucy laduca she's a construction i know these names <laughs> she's a construction worker by day drag queen by night mm-hmm. right the outfit, I mean, I, I know we can't see it all the way now, but, but, mm-hmm. but it's cute. Mm-hmm. I mean, I'll rent it. It's not nothing like, you know, wow. Yeah, it's giving me very much, um, what was that girl everybody wanted to do in the 90s? The blonde hair. Me? <laughs> Tomorrow, um, to my Pamela Anderson? Yeah. I don't see that. I, I see, I, 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 I go on. Anderson. I see that Meryl, for, 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 for some reason, she, she's giving me Meryl Street. You, you, know, you gotta see mm-hmm. that Depp comes her. Because they literally, that's what it's giving me in her face and stuff. Mm-hmm. But, but it's a cute outfit. I appreciate the bust, yeah. the bustiness, mm-hmm. but then you need to match the bottom to kind of go with it too. But well, that's what I'm saying. Pam Anderson, the body type, right. she had big okay. boobs, small, small waist. Right. Okay, okay. Which is like that '90s white girl mm. look that all everybody have. Not Magnolia. Nice. I see her outfit and I thought, okay, I've seen it before. But just because you saw it before doesn't mean anything. Because I mean, right. I'm a weird on stage anyway. I'm like, what do you, mm-hmm. what do you mean? The world hasn't seen it, so. Mm-hmm. I like it. Oh damn. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, I do not like those kitten heels. I freaking hate, I hate this look. See, even no, I hate I'm, I'm sorry, Mister, but even Eureka, Eureka says stuff like that. Rocking in my kitten heels. I'm sorry, Mistress. Don't curse me out, girl. No. You literally. I swear, you you are your own queen, and you are definitely your own queen. You but are. but I swear, if you and Eureka did something together, y'all would be sisters. Sis, no, for real, seriously, for real. Like and li- that's literally, you should make money off of it. Yeah, it's no read. It's no read at all. Yeah. Um, but, but this look is not. You don't, you don't like it? I like the hair. I like the head and the hair. But this, like, what's up with the, I do not like the kitten heels. And I do not like the lace. I'm sorry. I, I'm, I'm going to rent the look. Mm-mm. Mistress of Bell Brooks and I am the heavyweight champ. <laughs> Who is that? Oh, that comedian. Now, he's before our time, but we've seen him. That yeah. white that white comedian on, that wore the uh, side hat. And he the, was on SNL, too. And he had that red, a red curly kind of afro. He's, he's bigger guy. Little, he looks like Horatio Sands. I know. I, well, I can see that, too. Was, Sin. Him, yes. <laughs> <laughs> no. He's, <laughs> I, he looks familiar, both, but no. He like both of these people. Yeah. <laughs> he looks familiar, but I, I don't remember. Thank Sin you, Sam Kinison. This is... Uh, Oh, okay, yeah, we're gonna. He, no, he, if they had literally. a baby, if they had a baby, I'm gonna send this to you. Okay. Okay, well, I'll be Yolanda this season, okay, baby? <laughs> oh, not the Yolanda to the Selena. Now, come on, stop it. <laughs> mirror, mirror on the wall. Wait, why should they RuPaul for a bit? Yeah, she does. No, for real. Like, no, literally. She really does. I, that, I was thinking the same thing. I was literally just thinking she looks like Cher and RuPaul right, that's, mixed together. No, for real. Like, RuPaul back in 1937. Yeah. yeah. I love this outfit. I do too. I love the hair. It looks like a woman outfit. No, you know, yeah, and, and like I would wear it. But she reminds me of, of um Sahara Davenport. She passed away. Um, she was she was on yeah. 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 Um, and she also reminds me of Sheree. Oh yeah, from uh yeah Hawaii. yes 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 yes. 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 Mm-hmm. But I'm buying this outfit though. Yeah. Hey, I know Robin better than anybody else in this. Mm-hmm. Oh Lord, what have they done? I smelled the room already. Mm. <laughs> she should have wore a wig cap. Vinyl duct tape. Oh. All the lighting was a no-no, baby. I was just looking at that. I, I it's funny, it's funny she said that. Because I'm like, why her hair, why, why her scalp shining? Because mm-hmm. <laughs> the scalp really is shining. Okay. <laughs> so I can't. Uh-oh. They come the girl. But. You do know who they are playing off of, though, right? Yeah. Who? White chicks. No. Oh. You remember 
um, Batman the movie. Girl, I, 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 the no, Joker. Now she's making up stuff. Or not the Joker. Um, <laughs> oh. Um, remember Jim Carrey? Uh huh. When he was playing and he had those two girls. The um. They don't Joker. know who the, who the heck that is. <laughs> These girls are ten years old. They don't know. They don't they, know what it. What, I no. would, look at play. they play off of Bratz dolls. That's their thing. They don't. Mm-hmm. You know, they wouldn't even know who the Batman Remember is. Remember these girls? They're like the Batman. Does he shoot webs? Look, they're just no. You don't think so? You don't? Think no, I don't think so. Wait, if y'all are watching Sugar and Spice, did y'all take inspiration from Batman Forever? Yeah, Batman Forever with two characters called Sugar and Spice. But, um, but I love it because I love that was like one of my favorite things on Batman. But for other outfits, I, um, no, no shade. Yeah, it's just I, very no. It just goes back to what I was talking about with the Forever 21 stuff. Yeah. It's just like... Which I'm not against. I'm not either. It's just that... Never an intro look or whatever. Like, you know? I don't know. I mean, it's cute seeing them walking together. Yeah. Now, one twin definitely has more thicker, thicker thighs. Yeah. Uh, sugar does. Yeah, Ow. Sugar. She has <laughs> she has black in her. <laughs> have and, different dads. And, I, and by black in her, I mean me. <laughs> <laughs> JK, don't all kill me. Um... <laughs> Right, how old are they? <laughs> Check your IDs. <laughs> no, but um, yeah, the look goes. I mean, like, I, like I said, unfortunately, I have to like them. Unfortunately, <laughs> uh, so you know, I sort of gave me a reason not to. So uh, you know, but but sugar and spice, I have to keep it real. These outfits yes. do not excite me. They don't. Yeah. So you know, but. I think they're very annoying because it's like, mm, baby. Mm, 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 mm. <laughs> That's what I'm saying. Like, like, like. Yeah. Had I had I had I had not have I had not felt like they've been respectful towards me, I was like, oh my god, they're so annoying. <laughs> but I mean, y'all probably are a little annoying, but 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 y'all are still so cute. So I, you know, you know. Ooh. I do know them, but I'm not gonna give them the satisfaction that I do. <laughs> Miss Rich, you're my girl, like secretly. She's so Because you, you, you are the petty that I inspire my fans to be. And that's kind of petty. And you know what that means? Petty is great. Ow. Oh, I like um Spice's makeup. I mean, they're both kind of the same, but like I like that 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 crease up there. I'll be the chunky drag. No, Chucky is Pierre's thing. Okay. Okay, lace is lifting. Now, if Selena saying it's a lot, it's a lot because she's a lot. Yeah. A whole lot. And you know what? This is my thing with people like Selena. Mm-hmm. They're kind of like, they, and I don't know her. She seems very sweet. Right. But with people that are like that, that are over the top, they kind of like to be over the top and the only one being over the top. So sometimes when other uh, someone else can, can take the attention away from them, they mm-hmm. kind of start feeling a, a certain type of way. Right. Which I don't like because it's like if y'all are just, if you're just going to be like that, be okay with other be- people being like that with right. you. You know what I mean? Mm-hmm. Like, yeah. I will now say, she's just kind of giving like hating vibes right. in a little bit. No, I will say that I, I think I enjoyed the first group so far mm-hmm. more than this group Mm-hmm. So far, like as a as a as yeah. a premiere, yeah, definitely uh, was good. See, in such a coincidence, they moved to L.A. and happened to get on Drag Race. Mm-hmm. I really believe that they didn't audition. Yeah, no, they didn't audition. Like I like yeah. I, I mean, like Drag Race. I've heard stories before where they where they, they'll just call certain girls up and be like, "Hey, you want to get on?" And I believe that with them. I don't think they audition. And and this is my thing too. Like I feel like with this TikTok stuff. It's just so easy. Like, it's so easy for you to come up. And I'm like. Is it then? Because, I mean, nobody sees my stuff. Well, you're canceled. Oh. I'm just, I'm just... <laughs> Mother I knew it. Has arrived. Well, okay. I but, mean, it was good. No, but I'm kind of like. I just feel like. About time and dread. I mean, it could have something different. Because, like, we, cause it was funny the first time. Yeah. It, but, like, but I'm like. They don't pay vivacious any attention at all. Mm-hmm. So I'm like, uh, okay, I'm glad y'all gave her some kind of some mm-hmm. kind some kind of something. Yeah, because she was funny. Good for you, vivacious. Mm-hmm. <laughs> <laughs> I hate to see you leave. And I'd be mad if I came in as that other group, that as, as this group, and the first group actually had Ariana Ariana right. Grande right for the first thing <laughs> and had got to look for her or look at her for right for like, a long time, like two more minutes. Yeah, for real, <laughs> seriously. <laughs> <laughs> She still has that stink auntie oh waddle. Oh my god, it's so funny. <laughs> See, I'd be mad. 
so the first group had to get all wet, but they're just having wind, wind. like really. Wind. <laughs> so Literally. it's like, so it's like, it's like take a pick. It's like, yeah. like either you want Rihanna and get wet, or you want to get wet. Mm-hmm. Yeah, which one you want to do? Yeah, good job though. Mm-hmm. I don't surprise the guy has room in the back for the bike. <laughs> Tell her to glue down her wig for the first challenge. Okay, so she's—I know the fans are already going to hate her. I already know it. Like, but I think I think it's because like she takes her drag serious. Yeah. Not saying that sugar and spice don't, but it's like, bitch, I was doing drag before all this, and y'all doing it for the TikTok. That's what that's that's where that's where she's at, you know, with it. it. But but I just know like fans don't give her a hard time. She's that's just old school, old school queen. That's all. And she's bringing it. Yeah. (laughs) I appreciate that. It's yes. true. Cause so yes. many, cause you know, as so, so, so soon as girls get on here, they're like, Hey sister. sister. And then they'll go behind your back. Like, right, right, right. Now, 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 now. Like this is all phony. No, yeah. so, right. Yes. She's real. Yeah. I appreciate the realness. Nice. I'm surprised they're not doing the photo together. Yeah. Good one, Ru. <laughs> <laughs> No, Not you took her way off. <laughs> She's smart. Like <laughs> now, Mrs. But Mrs. Don't. But 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 that stuff that done that'll make you seem a little like bitter, which I get it because it's like those of us had to have had to audition more than once, and some girls don't even done drag for two months and they get on the first try. If they even audition, it's like it would make you feel some kind of way. I understand. I do get that like kind of sense of bitterness, but I do appreciate that she told them to their yeah. face. Yeah. Versus making it seem like she was talking about them right. behind their back while they were doing their photo shoot. So I feel like she came back in, right? Said her piece. Mrs. Mrs. Probably knows that. Produ- but she does sound kind of like that. Production favors them. That's probably what, that's probably what she knows. You have more followers. And- I'm mad. Their bodies are already getting fit. Yeah, I think I think, I think the next but thing the so next cute. thing after drag is OnlyFans. I see it now. No. It's so bad because Selena is so loud and she's annoyed by them. Yeah. <laughs> but they, well, like it's like I can deal with them maybe in doses. You know, a little bit. Yeah. It's like okay. Yeah. Like, the, yeah, there would be that whole. Both of them would be the group that I go to like during Pride and party with. Right. And then I'd be like, okay, I'm going to my cave. Now. Right. <laughs> <laughs> and I'll like all their pictures on TikTok and uh-huh. then not see them till next year. Right. No, they're definitely. And then have a lot of fun talking. Oh, so yeah, Lucy but, won the photo shoot. Who won the last photo shoot? Do you remember? I don't remember. Yeah, the one with the orange. Oh, she won. Uh-huh. Okay, good. Oh, thank you. Girl. Thank you. There's a lot of queens. Oh, my God. But this is kind of the first, because like, normally when they've done it before, the queens will meet each other while they're in drag. But now they, ha- they don't, they don't hide to each other looking drag, yeah. so, it's kind of, so it's kind of different. If we sound dead and dry, it's because we are. <laughs> Right. <laughs> like right, um. this is draining. <laughs> this is draining. We watched a whole movie. We hung out today, and then we're watching two premieres. Yeah, we're tired. And this is with a, a body full of sugar, and we literally right. ate ourselves with sugar. And, and we're still dead. <laughs> <laughs> and it's like thirty girls. So yeah, we're over it. Sorry. One of you will be going home. Can you send at least five home, please? It's too many girls. <laughs> it looks like him and as the doll said, we have. Thousand pounds of sugar in us, and we're and we're done. <laughs> Keep falling asleep. Um, thank God that was it. Like I, I, I really thought it was gonna be the runway and the talent show. So it's like okay. Yeah. I the ending was kind of lame though. Like I really, yeah, it was so corny. Yeah. I, like, have you ever walked into a bar? Yeah. No. I think that second portion so of this premiere was kind of boring. It was unnecessary. Yeah. They could have just brought everybody in. Honestly, they yeah. At once. Like, or honestly, they could have made that three episodes. Like they could have made the first episode <sighs> with the reveal, whatever, and then mm-hmm. the talent show, and then the second one, the talent show, and then the third one is like. No, somebody said they have. Somebody said they have another episode. Yeah, yeah bitch, you're going to be. <laughs> <laughs> there is not another episode. <laughs> No, it's not. Not until, not until, <laughs> not until next week. <laughs> I hope. I'm going home. Wait, I don't blame you. I don't blame you. Because <laughs> I may have to watch this tomorrow, bitch. 
I'm going home. I have, to, I have school in the morning. How was like, that part <laughs> one? That was literally two parts. That was literally two parts. It was, yeah. <laughs> oh, girl, bye. There's a part two. Yeah, no. The part... <laughs> The part two. I think the part two is a talent show in the runway. Oh my god. Yeah, no. <laughs> I wish you could. I wish. <laughs> oh my god. Are you going to stay up for that? No. I'm done too, bitch. <laughs> uh-uh. Uh-uh. No, absolutely not. Yeah, no. <laughs> I'm sorry, but no. <laughs> well, we won't be watching that tonight. <laughs> that'll, be, that'll be another raw view, but... um. For sure. What did you think overall of this? I liked first it. Like premiere? I agree with the first. Uh, I like the first group better. I feel like they they work together better. I mm -hmm. feel like they it was like seamless. The second was, I don't know. It was, I don't know. I think there's a lot of Connecticut people. Mm -hmm. And I don't know if they did that on purpose. Because they've never had Connecticut, Connecticut girls on there. I think they're trying to pull from different areas within every week. But at the yeah. same time, why would you make so many of them at the same time? Like, just get them out the way because we're not going to call them for another. Maybe. Penny. Or they probably <laughs> all have drama together. Who knows? Yeah. Your earring came off again. <laughs> <laughs> I don't even care no more. Your nose ring. And then I have to edit all this. <laughs> oh, and there's two. Oh, my God. You got to hold another one. I'm watching that on a. Well, I can't wait because I'm. Next I love week. watching your reviews. But yeah. No, I like them. I like them all. I, honestly, I, I like them all. I think this is going to be a good season. Do you think it was a, a, it. a good, um, oh my God, premiere? Like, yeah, other so. seasons that you have watched, do you think it's like yeah. one of the best ones? Best? Yeah. No. Me either. Not one of the best. But the, but the but girls it, it was good. The girls are kind of entertaining. Though. Yeah, they're entertaining. Yeah, yeah, they are. I like the personalities. I yeah. see a lot of personalities that are different, which I like. Anybody who you think stands out? I know it's hard to remember names, but um, anybody that stands the out girl, the most? Obviously, with uh -huh. sugar mistress. And spice. Yeah, yeah mm -hmm. mistress, sugar and spice. I really like them. Um, How about Selena? Or or she too much for you? Which one's Selena? The, the one that's too much, the Chola. Oh, the Chola. <laughs> I like her. Yeah, I like her. Okay. Um, she's definitely gonna bring some um spunk. Um. From the first group, how about I can't remember now, honestly. I like the girl, the fantasy girl. Okay. I think she brings a little edge to uh -huh. the to the group too. There's not really um, any artsy queens besides, like I guess, the fantasy one. Yeah, but, the fantasy one. Um, do you like Sasha? Who's Sasha? The icon. She, I, I like her. She seems sweet. Um. But I think she's kind of she's kind of giving me like um, what's the Asian girl's name who always comes back? Jujube. Jujube. How? Kinda. Like, like in the sense where she's just like everybody knows her. She's coming to the show. I don't know. Like I don't know if it's. I don't, I don't know. Jujube. Just kind of like a fan favorite type thing. Oh um, well. It's kind of like what I'm getting from her. But um yeah, I'm gonna we're gonna go. Just thank you for always for for coming back. Thank you, you know, even amongst all the haters and all that. Um and I thought it was just one. It was more. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> You're canceled too, you didn't know. <laughs> like There's more than one. I thought it was just the one that wrote that uh, no. angry letter to management. <laughs> I forgot that I forgot that letter. <laughs> I was like, okay. But yeah, so um, yeah, catch us. I will catch her another time. She yeah. should come back again. I'll be back. And um, everybody, if not, I'll be on the lives. Yeah, at night, late at night. Stay beat. Stay beautiful. Most importantly, stay, stay blessed. blessed. Kima Cho or, or Kamochi. We're so dead. <laughs> yeah. I'm so white. <laughs> Literally, no. I'm so white. Look at this brightness. <laughs> Casey, your job is still safe. I'm so white. I'm confused. Where is the manager? Where is FUBU?